Go. Hello, Blockineers. Do you want to? Let's put our hats down. All right. And we go. Hello, Blockineers. Today we are at Bolsa Chica Ecological Reserve, and we're going to do some hiking. We brought along with us the coldest water to help us cool down on this hot day. Let's get started. Wait, so located in Huntington Beach. Located in Huntington Beach, this is a 1300 acre wetland with over 200 aviation species. Yeah. Located in Huntington. Things pause. Hi. Located in Huntington Beach, this is a 1300. Wait. Located in Huntington Beach, this is a 1300 acre wetland with over 200 aviation species. This is a really short loop, Dada. Oh, look. Sure. Marsh. Oh. Look at this marsh. It's like a huge lake. I don't know what the difference is. But... You see something at you know, two o'clock? Oh, there's a bird over there. Do you see all the footprints? Yep. Are you mention it? Yeah. Tell people not to go. Yeah. It seems like many people have stepped over this barbed wire line, which they're not supposed to, but there's so many footprints all over. Nope. There's even some footprints on the very edge of that rock there. Imagine someone falls inside the marsh. Go, go, go. Nelly. 
Alright, let's go. Whoever gets to the other end gets the drink first. Oh, no. The water doesn't look too clean. Because I can't see through it. Yeah, see, the other side of the bridge also has a maximum occupancy. So only 375 people can go on the bridge. Go with the camera, it's not run a snake up over. Usually just ground squirrels. Bolsa Chica Preserve, you have to be very careful for rattlesnakes in the hole. Uh, there's no rattlesnakes. These are probably brown squirrel holes. And plus, there are snakes here. There's no rattlesnakes. Please. There's a very nice sea breeze because we're like right next to the ocean. Oh, you can see so, so many people are at the beach. Maybe a few weeks ago, that, I think there was a fire. Really? Yeah, this one is sick, right? You can point it out. Yeah. Well, it looks like oh, quite, quite. I'm pretty sure a few weeks ago there was a fire here. It seems like this place is still recovering from the fire. The ground is all blackened and stuff. Hopefully, uh, there's no it, fire right now. It looks like wood. Alright, quiet. Alright, quiet. Alright, read the trivia and Boo will try to answer. Right, take off your mask now, Boo Boo. Take your mask off, boy. Alright, and go. Is that bottom? Mm -hmm. Hey, kids, what can you do to help the Bosa Chica Ecological Reserve? Okay, should you follow the rules to protect habitat and wildlife, brother? Mm -hmm. Should you participate in 
the C C C D at the B C E R with your family or school? I don't know what that is, so no. <laughs> the answer is yes. And do you become a member of the organizations dedicated to protecting these wetlands? It's D, all of the above. Come on. Do, don't you know that the answer's right over there? Ah. <laughs> Okay, here we go. We've reached another viewpoint and we basically have the whole view of the marsh now. It goes from all the way down there to all the way over here. Um, and now we're going to head back because this trail just goes on forever and ever. One thing I will say though about the Bolsa Chica Ecological Reserve is I don't like how there's cars so nearby. This is the Pacific Coast Highway and basically we can hear car after car after car. So it's not very naturey when you can hear that. A water break. Um, uh, mention it. Mention the, the cold. Hmm? Mention the coldness. So the water is still very cold. That's the whole point of the coldest water is that it keeps water very cold for up to 24 hours. Oh no, for more than. So the, what the coldest water does is it keeps water cold for more than 24 hours, and that's why our water is still nice and cool. There's still a lot of ice cubes in here. By the way, you can order the coldest water bottle at the link in the description and use the code LWB to save 10% off your entire purchase. And you can also enter the coldest giveaway at the description as well. is very strange because I haven't seen cactus anywhere else in this marsh area. maximum occupancy for the bridge which is 375 people so if there's 376 then this bridge will collapse all right go hey kid okay this is another trivia question oh uh, how about this is don't say another because we're in the beginning, so oh, I'll yeah. put it just in the beginning. Over here is a trivia question. Which of the following are fin fish? Okay, so I'm going to say the fish, and then you're going to say yes or no for fin fish. Okay, brother? Take your mask off. Okay, tuna. Yes. Scallop. No. Marlin. Yes. Rockfish. No. Bay shrimp. No. Rock crab. Yeah. Halibut.
Wait, I mean tuna marlin, rock, crab, halibut, and corbina. Tuna marlin, rock, crab, halibut, corbina. So all three on the bottom plus tuna and marlin. Uh -huh. Tuna marlin, oh, rock, fish, halibut. Oh, you were very close, brother. Uh -uh. I'm covering it with the coldest water. I re read the question. Can you match each object with its use, brother? Curved throwing stick. C. Good. Um, the next one. The, the money. The B. Preserve. You can mention that it actually moves. Yeah, uh -huh. I was going right, yeah. So we have finished hiking at the Bolsa Chica Eco. Uh. So we have finished hiking at the Bolsa Chica Ecological Reserve. Brother, what do you think of this place? Oh, I said reserve or preserve. Oh, reserve. Okay. All right. And then. Uh, yeah, I know. I yeah. Know. Continue. Yeah. Brother, what do you think of this place? It was pretty good. It feels. I wish that. Wait, talk to the camera. It was pretty good. I, I. It was pretty good. I. It was pretty good. Uh, it was pretty good. But I wish that the cars weren't nearby. Okay. I also wish the cars weren't nearby. But I'm going to talk about the main trail we went on, which we just went for a little bit and then turned back. However, that main trail is actually one big loop that you could probably complete in one or two hours or so, but today is kind of hot, so we just didn't have the energy to do it. And also we did this little loop at the start. So yeah, we could do the main big loop in the future, sorry. We could do the main big loop in the future, but maybe on a cooler day. And speaking of hot days, I think we need some water. Oh, drink some colors water, boo. Good enough. <coughs> Hold it, I almost dropped it. Come on, I thought you had it. Got it? Now take a drink. Wait, wait. It doesn't work. Yep. Over here is the nature center. Unfortunately, it is closed due to the pandemic, but they do have some information there that you can pick up from that table. <laughs> 